using auto internet just watch this video how to change the username and password these are the lights should come in the modem phone light internet light and if you are using LAN, LAN should become Wi-Fi light then it will work on the internet light is coming means you will get internet light internet uh, northway there are two technologies doxis and jipon jipon means fiber optic doxis means coaxial cable this is a jipon device and you will get this is a fiber optic cable patch card is connected here exactly if exactly connected means pond light will come in uh, green light if not means come in jipon there are three devices jetty see you are able to see jetty this is a jetty device and and there are three another two devices are present as i told northway there are uh, three types of jipon devices are present if you want to change the username and password in jipon i will tell you another two devices are uh, genixis and jetty 601 and 6 660 and now as of now i will tell you how to change the username and password in f jte 660 first you should connect to the wi-fi whatever present you in your home that wi-fi you should connect then only you can able to change the password connected and next go to the chrome here you type it as a 192.168.1.1 and give enter before that give enter you should turn up the mobile data and you will get like refresh will get like this page if you turn off only mobile data should be turn off and you will get like this here go to admin username is small letters admin and password is uh, router backside will be present that mac address first line mac address mac like that is a without icon you should enter without icon you should enter whatever is there you should enter mac address v5 after this validation code you enter after give login you will get login page like this here go to network network option and in the same place only you will get wlan option wlan here the configuration should be if you have any speed issue you have any problem you are not getting range means you need to change bandwidth as 40 megahertz and channel should be 9 9 will support for all devices old device new device all device. and external channel should be upper after give submit now it will disconnect again you have to connect connected go to that page only and you want to know the username where we have to change the username and password right here ssid settings is there right here you can change the username uh, keep anything if you want anything you can keep as of now i'll keep as bmsn and after giving name wi-fi name make submit after submitting it will disconnect after you have again you have to go to the Wi-Fi here yeah, you got to see BMSN whatever you again name that name is came and again you enter the password 
enter the password if and connect after connecting go to google chrome yes yeah, same that page only refresh make it refresh and same steps go to network and wlan and below ssid security will be present press on that make it enable here you can change password whatever you can give minimum eight letters should be there i will give as one two three four five six seven eight nine eight nine zero i will give anything you want to keep you can give after make submit continue it will disconnect now and you go to wi-fi again you have to enter the wi-fi password because you change it right it will not connect again it will ask password or give forgot again you connect three four five six seven eight nine zero whatever you can connect and it will be connected this is the process how to change the uh, username and password if you want to know another devices like jetty uh, genixis technical or doxis device how to change means watch the next video you will get you will able to see please subscribe and encourage me